everyone. My name is Mark Fisher. I'm an applications engineer with Printistat, and you're here watching Unc Fish's CAD tricks and tips. What we're going to look at today is getting control of your mouse, specifically the buttons. Most, most users have a particular way they like to draft. I'm just going to show you how to get in and change the settings. First things first, right click, go to options. I'm going to come up here to my user preferences tab and down to right click customization and this is how i have them set there is no preference that is right or wrong it is best for how you like to make it work if you don't like it one way try it the other way see if you get used to it so there are three modes and the modes are related to what is selected or not if there's nothing selected i like mine to show me the repeat last command if i'm in the middle of an edit mode I want to see a shortcut. And last but not least, if I'm in the middle of a command, I want my right click to show me enter or to function as enter. I'm going to click apply and close. I'm going to click OK. And we're going to slide out of the way here just to show you how it works. So left click, left click, left click. Nothing out of the ordinary yet. I right click, it ends my command. Now, if I right click again, I'm immediately starting in the draw command or the line command. Next things I want to do, if I want to do a polyline, I want to end my command and I want to start another polyline. Very, very quick and easy. Next thing to show you is that middle option when there are two, when there are things selected. So I'm going to highlight, I got my grips going, I'm going to right click. Now you can see I have access to all kinds of tools, tricks, properties, and other gizmos. <clears throat> That's the right click button. Let's take a look at that middle button. Most mice are three buttons uh, out of the case. There are other mice that you can grab uh, and order from any all kinds of places that are going to have lots and lots and lots of different options. Um, if you're a gamer, you already know what I'm talking about. Um, for my sake, I'm just going to look at what we have for the standard three button mouse. And this one, you got to type M button pan. Hit enter. And let's take a look at what the help option or the help menu says. So I like mine set at one, where it supports panning when you hold and drag the button or the wheel. That's what 95% of the people that I have worked with like to see. So I'm just going to leave it set at one, press my middle mouse button, I'm now panning. If I'm not panning and I roll one way or the other, now I'm zooming. Another trick, you can double click and it'll zoom extends for you. You can see my little intro there and all of our crazy little lines. I'm going to delete those. I'm going to double click the mouse wheel again and zoom out a little bit. And there we go. Quick and easy. That's how you gain control of your mouse, both of the buttons that you have access to. I'm Uncle Fish, and thanks for watching.